there's a long discussion, even an argument, trying to find out the roots of Hinduism. Hindu is not even a Sanskrit word. The historians say that some 4,000 years ago, an Aryan people came across the Indus River and brought with them these teachings that formed into Hinduism. 3,800 years ago, Abraham, Abraham, our father, sent his sons that he had with Gutura to the land of the East. These sons' names are still well known in India today. For instance, one of the sons' names is Asharim. Our sages tell us that this means a camp. Today in India, a camp is called an ashram. Another one of the sons' names is a Veda. The scriptures in India are called the Vedas. Another son's name is Shiva. One of the three main gods in India is Shiva. Hindu means from the river. Hebrew, which these boys would have called themselves coming from Abraham, means from across the river. Brahmanism is the name of the religion, not Hinduism. And Brahmanism comes from the name Abraham. What is Hinduism's message to the Jews who are in India? One of the most sacred books in all of Hinduism is called the Bhagavad Gita. In this book, there's a story of a prince, a warrior prince,